On the way this half hour, we'll talk with some folks who have helped make one institution on the south side the place to go for decades. Have you heard of Bear's Barbershop? If not, you will. Make sure and stick around for that. Also, we're going to be talking about Project Help. This involves those with eating disorders. We'll talk to someone who has been down that road and has gotten treatment and is in recovery. Don't miss it. And a little bit later on, it is Warren and Griffin. Only Warren is here, but he's got a very special guest, Judge Russell Bean. Why is Judge Bean in our studios along with Mark Warren? We'll find out together between now and 1030. So make sure and stick around here with us and let's chat. Welcome to Let's Chat, the Tennessee Valley's premier show focusing on lifestyle and entertainment bringing you smart shopping tips, community events, and the newest trends. Now, Let's Chat. Welcome and good morning. It's Let's Chat for Tuesday. This is March the 8th. I'm Chip Chapman. Glad to have you here with us. We've got a jam-packed show. We're going to begin things here talking with a local basketball legend. If you don't believe me, well, you should. We're going to find out here and spend a few minutes with Shambi Hi. Shambi, first of all, good morning and thanks for joining us. Um, looking at some stats on you back in 1992 at Brainerd High, you were the man basketball wise. Wow. And you still are the man, right? Kind of, yes. <laughs> undefeated in 1992? Yes, totally sir. undefeated. Wow. And, uh, did you win the state championship that year? Yes, sir, we did. We did. Wow. Undefeated for an entire basketball season. I'm not sure anybody's done that ever since. How did it feel when you were throwing the last basketball of your high school career and it went in? Nothing but that. Totally amazing. Totally Definitely. amazing. Yes, totally amazing, yes. And after that, you went on to play for the University of Miami? Yes, sir. And tell me what you're doing now. What I'm doing now is uh, I'm a freight broker. Uh, with a company called CLC Express out of Antioch, Tennessee, uh, which is led by another basketball player here uh, who played in Chattanooga back in 92, around the time I did at City High School. His name right. is uh, Cordell Clemens. Uh, yeah. So that's what I'm doing now. That's what you're doing now. Yes, you are uh, obviously very well accomplished in your field, but you're standing in the shadows of somebody pretty tall, and that's your father, Larry yes, High, better yes. known as Bear, yes. who owns and operates Bear's Barbershop. I imagine as a young man, you spent a lot of time hanging around the barbershop, right? Certainly, certainly, yes. So you have, what, 15, 20,000 uncles throughout the years? <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> tell, me, yes. tell me something, one of the best pieces of advice that you learned from all the customers at the mm. barbershop and from your dad, Bear. Mm. Yes, uh, one of the most valuable lessons that I learned was uh, to never, ever give up, no matter what you're facing, to go through it uh, with a great attitude. And so uh, several of dad friends uh, shared that message with me to echo all throughout the barbershop. After they would come in, laugh and joke and cut up, you know, then the seriousness came and those lessons were very valuable. And you have a youngster of your own, correct? I do, yes. How young? Well, the youngest is five. The youngest is... Five. And you're going to pass that lesson you learned from your dad and your thousands of uncles over the years onto Certainly. your own kids, right? Certainly. Yes. All right. Yes. Well, your dad is sitting over here in the corner, so we're going to bring out the man, the myth, the legend, uh, who is beginning his 53rd year in business. Is that right? Ooh, Hard yes, to believe, isn't yes, it? Yes, yes, yes. If you haven't heard of Bear's Barbershop, shame on you. You should have. We're going to be back and talk with Shambi's dad, Larry High, better known as Bear when we continue on this Tuesday edition of Let's Chat.